我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我我The date is May 21st of this year, of course, at Sha Tin Jockey Club House. Okay. So May 21st is a Saturday Jockey Club in Sha Tin. So mark your calendar, please. That's very important. Now, then the second purpose is just to put everyone on the same page. Put everyone on the same page. Because your your uh, uh, vegetarian friends or maybe your um, president, incoming president in your area, may ask you, okay, what is DTA? Okay, because they have attended uh, PAPS. What is district training assembly? Now, the uh, the answer is okay. It's a it's an opportunity for club president elect uh, to build on PAPS training to learn on leadership skills and the other club leaders. Also, to learn the responsibility, club leadership teams to refine the goals. So that's why DTA is not just for incoming president. It's for other, other club members and also in particular their club leaders. Okay, so it's very important. So separate the tax and DTA. Very different objective, even though they are both trained programs. And also, second objective is prepare incoming leaders for the year in the office and build a leadership team. So we help them to build a leadership team. So that's the purpose of the DTA. And also, to give uh, for DTE Peter, uh, the incoming AG and DAGs and other district committees the opportunity to motivate the club and also to start to build a relationship. So it's working relationship building through the district uh, training assembly. Okay. It used to be called train district assembly per se, okay, but uh, somehow they added training just to make sure that people remember it's a training program. Now, so with this in in our mind, so what I would like to well encourage you is well you your DHGs and also the committee should be there. Okay, because it's building working relationship and motivate them, right? If you are not there, how can you motivate them? So it's difficult. So mark your calendar, May 23rd, Saturday at the Charging Jockey Club. And also to build working relationship, it's important that the format cannot be one-way communication. It has to be well interactive. So all the AGs and DAGs and other members, committee members will be involved in facilitating and facilitating in some of the workshops okay so that will be the uh, the main purpose of the district assembly so you will be involved now then well as the old chairman from the old club <laughs> let me share with you okay even though uh, with the help of DGEP that uh, I don't look that as old as uh, my brother but anyway, I have attended more district assembly than many of you. Okay? More than 20 district assembly. Believe me or not. Okay? Sometimes we overlook the afternoon. Okay? Sometimes. There usually and traditionally there's a district budget discussion in the afternoon. And we have to get it through. Okay? I think as a team, we have to get it through as smoothly as possible. Okay, so there's yeah, some preparation work. Okay, and also some soft selling to do beforehand. Okay, now I have seen district budget pass through smoothly. <laughs> I have also seen district budget debated 
furiously in the district training assembly. Okay? Now, pass 唔到咧就麻煩。OK， 嗱 ，quiz 咧就會加多一個字喺中間。So, uh, I, I mean, the PDG Anthony, who is the expert, okay, if we do not pass it, then of course there are ways to pass it later on, but it's going to be, well, uh, a bit, well... Uh, it's easier now than before. Yeah, because I guess we right. had one year, we really had great fun, I you remember. Yeah, we <laughs> so, I, I want to take a time to, to highlight it, because there's some uh, well, preparation, professional preparation, and also some... Well, soft selling we may have to do, okay? So to make the, uh, the session smooth as silk, okay? Just a friendly reminder, okay? Now, usually the uh, district assembly is structured in this way. So there are different sessions. Uh, they did the uh, uh, present elect will attend uh, public speaking, leadership, uh, and some case studies, and the other club leaders will separately attend roles and responsibility, goal setting, etc. And then they come together and have team building, um, uh, club rules, uh, and then of course the February session on uh, themes and uh, and also district goals. Okay. Now we will send you the information. So from now on, <coughs> we will uh, well refine the uh, the content. Of course, uh, well, uh, cursory we invite all the all the uh, past district governors to lead the session. Okay. But your involvement is very important and your leadership. So, and then we talk about the, con uh, the logistics and promotion, Natron, etc. So I don't want to bore you. Okay. So that will be the uh, district training assembly. Well, thank you, uh, Bonnie, for your <laughs> And actually, a bit of time. Thank you.